Welcome back, YouTube. So now we have a story time on the first time I got bit by a pet bull. Now I got a scar on my leg today because of this. And I'm breaking out some gas because I'm about to go roll up. Well, not go roll up, but go smoke with my girl and stuff. So I'm breaking out some gas and I feel roll up before I go do that. But while, while I break down this gas and roll up, I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all the story time on the time that um, I got bit by a pet bull on me so this whole story time takes place when i was about like seven years old um you know i was just a regular kid i used to hang out with all the kids on the block me and my brother used to you know we used to just chill hang out jump on the trampoline play freeze tag play karate and shit like that you know do doing kids shit you know what i'm saying now it was these older kids that we used to hang out with and chill with they used to do it. some of the older boys. It seemed like everybody used to do karate back then for some reason. Like, everybody did karate. But it was these older kids that we used to hang out with. They used to show us a little karate things. Because their, their, I think their dad was, like, a karate master or some shit like that. So, they used to show us uh, all this shit. No, he wasn't karate master. He just... I don't know. He just used to show us karate and shit. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck the nigga was on. No, it was their step... Their, not their, uh, it's their uncle that did karate. Their dad, I think that nigga just sold weed or some shit. Because he had a couple cars. He had a big ass house on the block. And they had a whole bunch of pet bulls and shit. But, yeah. They had a pet bull. They had a male pet bull. And they had a female pet bull. It was a pretty ass little pet bull. Um, I think it's part, it was like one of the big ones. It wasn't like, you no. Know, it was like a pit rock. Or, I don't know what the fuck you would call it, but it was like one of those big pit bulls. It wasn't one of those little bitty baby. You know what I'm saying? It was like one of those big pit bulls. You know what I'm saying? With the big faces. Yeah, those hoes. So they had one of those motherfuckers, and they were walking around. And we were just, you know, being kids, playing around on the trampoline and shit. And somehow, I had got off the trampoline. I don't know what the fuck I was doing, but... I thought it was okay to be off the trampoline when there's a dog. Just, you know. I didn't think no shit because he had him on the leash. So, somehow I'm off the trampoline. The boy walks by. He has a dog. And I don't know what the fuck was going through his head. But he was, like, playing around and shit. Like, trying to scare me or whatever with the dog. And he kept on saying, sick, sick, sick. And trying to tell the dog to attack me. Now I think about my mama should have sued. My mama should have motherfucking. She thought about suing, but she should have fucking sued. But yeah, um, like I was saying, what was I saying? What was I saying? He was telling the dog to sick, 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 like to get at me on some shit. And the dog fucked around, actually like jumped at me, bit my leg. I got a scar like on my on my knee. I got a big ass scar. And, yeah, after that, he told the dog to let go. Do, do, do the dog let go. He took the dog to the house. And I was trying to, like, walk back to the crib. But my friends and shit, they were like, nah, because, like, do you not see your leg? Like, you fucked up. And I looked down at my leg, and I looked at my leg. And I saw my, like, my meat was coming out of my fucking leg. And I was, like, like, literally, like, it was, like, that much, like, that much out, like, my meat was hanging out my leg that much. And I was, like, I kind of, like, was, like, what the fuck? And so I was, like, can y'all just walk me back to the crib? Now, the whole time, I'm calm as fuck, like, bro, real talk. Like, even as a little kid, like, I don't know, I think I was just kind of shocked. I didn't feel the pain. I don't know what the fuck it was, but... I wasn't fucked up about it, so I was like, I, I was like, nah, I can walk. Uh, they were like, nah, cuz, like, you can, nah, cuz, uh, so I was like, can y'all just, like, help me, like, carry me over there then? And they were like, yeah. So they carried me to the house, and um, one of my friends, they had ran a little faster to go tell my mom what happened and stuff. So by then, they already, my mom was coming outside. And they're carrying me up there to my mama and shit. And she tells them to put me in the car. And she asked, she's asking them what happened with the woo. And she's pissed as fuck. 
you know, talking to her shit. But she was like, she was like, I gotta take you to the doctor and shit. So she takes me to the doctor. We chill in there for a little while. They fuck around, take us to the back. They say that I can't get stitches because it's a dog bite. You know, if I get stitches, it will get infected or some shit like that. So they said that I just gotta like do something. They said just put some shit over it and make sure, you know, keep it wrapped up. So that's what I did. I just keep kept it wrapped up and. I think eventually all the the meat and shit went went down or whatever or I don't know it healed by itself or some 